When hard things get done, they seem simple. Um, this was a significant undertaking that had been in motion for a long time as it related to the nonprofit collaborative center. And then once that center was here, it was extremely innovative to say, I'm going to bring in all the other services and create this campus. One of the main benefits of the campus is being able to help people navigate to get the services they need all in one location. So the buildings being near each other and us being able to walk people over to where they need to be is critical to making sure that their experience is the best it can be and they get the services that they need. The services that I access through the housing department this year are the MIHU program as well as the down payment assistance program. I think it provides um, a sense of hope, first and foremost, that, um, and also in addition to hope, but that there is a possibility for them to, um, to achieve that goal of home ownership. Well, this new campus is going to be wonderful for everyone um, because it's going to be one stop and you'll have access to um, Making Change program, the MIHU program, um, and I think it's just going to be wonderful because people won't be nervous about, did I miss something? Am I at the right location? Because they're only going to have to come to one spot. <laughs> As the Director of Heritage Housing Partners, I feel the co-location has provided several opportunities for us specifically to partner with other organizations that we may or may not have partnered with. It also provides great opportunities to assist residents um, and actually be able to do a physical warm handoff of clients to other services and other organizations that are also co-located on the campus. So a lot of times that we'd have to maybe pick up the phone, try to figure out who the right person is. So one of the benefits of this multi-agency campus is that if necessary, I can just go next door and maybe talk to somebody at Housing or Community Action Services and it's easier for me to get somebody. The idea of having a central place where there are all kinds of resources that support the community um, is, I think it's incredibly important because um, very often people come, you know, with one or two needs and discover that they can't get them met in a single office and they, um, they don't have the resources to travel all over Howard County to find the people who can help them. What I like about this place is it's much more spacious than what the previous location was. There's a larger variety of die cuts. There's also a larger variety of resources for parents or for teachers to help them with handling some other younger kids or school age children. This location is also a lot easier to get to because there's not as much congestion on the way here or on the way out whenever you're leaving. A lady came and um, she had an, a housing issue. She thought it was discrimination, but she really needed to go to housing, which is directly across the hall from us. We were able to interview her, find out what it is specifically that she, that she needed, clearly understood that it wasn't discrimination, and was able to take her to where she belonged. And we felt good over that. And she said, well, you, this is nothing like it used to be because I remembered five years ago, and she began talking about that. And I had a young military couple call. They were having some financial issues. Um, after talking to them for a little bit, realized that they could have potentially been a victim of a scam. So was able to refer them to our Office of Consumer Protection for um, uh, further investigation. So it, it's having the, those resources, those offices, those people so close by. You know, many times it, if, if someone doesn't have things like transportation or um, you know, maybe they need staff to attend things with them to help them get in and out of the car. It could be that going to multiple places could be um, very difficult. So having everything in one um, cohesive location makes it much easier for people to get their needs met more efficiently. Having this one location, they have more of a um, uh, uh, togetherness and also they have more fears like uh, they feel um, um, at ease knowing that they can just uh, knock on the door of other services within the campus that help them tremendously. You just walk to the different buildings or the different offices and, and everything is right here together on the same campus. I'm just glad that the county has made this happen and I'm hoping that other communities model it not just in Maryland but throughout the country because it's it's just an it's an excellent idea and definitely there's a lot of heart there and the thought for the people who need the services more than 
you know, let's put a building here, let's put a building there, let's, you know, it's really, there was a great thought about the community when this was done. So I, I think it's, I think it's awesome that we did this. I feel that this campus um, really represents the spirit of our community, which has always had a focus on what's in the best interest of the residents. And it's really a testimony to what makes it more convenient for the families. Um, in a sense, for us, it's a dream come true. And um, I feel like it's a one-stop obstacle buster where families can come in and have access to so many different services. As a lady described to me on, on Tuesday, it gave her a fuzzy feeling, a fuzzy warm feeling um, to be able to come to this place. And I asked her why. And she said, because I know that I can get everything I need right here.